intrigue, scandal, and a rumored plot to overthrow the throne. It is an unlikely backstory to the close relationship between Prince Albert II of Monaco and his first cousin once removed, Melanie Antoinette Costello de Massey, who has followed in her mother's footsteps and become a trusted member of the royal inner circle. Now she is by Princess Charlene's side as she continues her triumphant return to royal life. When Princess Charlene of Monaco stepped out for an engagement last week, it wasn't her husband, Prince Albert II, who stood by her side, but an unfamiliar face. The immaculately coiffured brunette, sophisticated in a blazer and silk camisole, joined Charlene, 45, as she attended Mass to commemorate Saint Devote, the patron saint of Monaco. The previous night, the royal aide was again by the princess's side as she took her children to an evening event that involved burning a model boat on which Saint Devote is said to have traveled, according to Vanity Fair Spain. The royal insider is Melanie Antoinette Costello de Massey, the daughter of Prince Albert's cousin, Baroness Elizabeth and de Massey, who served as a support for his parents, Prince Rainier III and Princess Grace of Monaco. Melanie Antoinette supported Princess Charlene of Monaco as she ventured out without her husband, who was keeping a low profile after being diagnosed with COVID-19 for a third time. The two appeared perfectly at ease with each other, suggesting a personal connection and closeness that is undoubtedly much needed in the fishbowl of royal life. An understated presence, Melanie Antoinette was also on hand to help Prince Albert at public engagements during Princess Charlene's period of extended absence, firstly, at home in South Africa, then at an overseas inpatient clinic where she received treatment for exhaustion. Notably, Melanie Antoinette attended the Saint Devote commemorations and the Monte Carlo Masters with the reigning prince. However, there was a time when Elizabeth and Melanie Antoinette's privileged position at the very heart of the Monegasque royal family was far from guaranteed. Indeed, Elizabeth's mother, Antoinette de Monaco, Baroness de Massey, the elder sister of Prince Rainier III, once tried to oust her younger brother as ruler of the principality. The tensions began with the arrival of Elizabeth, who was born outside of wedlock to Antoinette and her partner, Alejandro Athanase Noakes, an international tennis champion and lawyer. The birth was met with much fanfare as Elizabeth was the first grandchild of Princess Charlotte, Duchess of Valentinois, who, as the illegitimate daughter of the then-ruling Prince Louis II, was heir presumptive to the throne, she later renounced her rights in favor of her only son, Rainier. However, it was only once Antoinette and Alejandro married in 1951 that Elizabeth was added to the line of succession. Antoinette and Alejandro welcomed two more children, Baron Christian Louis and Baroness Christine Alex, before divorcing in 1954. Antoinette then began a relationship with Jean Charles Ray, president of the Monegasque Parliament. Together, according to Vanity Fair, Antoinette and Ray hatched a plan to dethrone Rainier, who was unmarried and had no children. They reportedly spread a rumor that his girlfriend, the French actress Giselle Pascal, was unable to conceive, apparently in the hope the lack of heir would spook Parliament into recognizing her son, Christian Louis, then just a young boy, as next in line to the throne, and make Antoinette regent until he came of age. It is thought the rumors partly drove the end of Rainier and Pascal's relationship. Shortly afterwards, he met Grace Kelly, whom he married in 1956. Kelly, the legendary actress-turned-royal, is credited with convincing her husband to expel his ambitious older sister. Antoinette went on to marry, then divorce, Ray, before walking down the aisle for a third time with British ballet dancer John Brian Gilpin, who died of a heart attack just six weeks after their 1983 wedding. In between the ups and downs of her colorful love life, Antoinette was readmitted to the court and given a handful of honorary positions, however, despite the uncertainty surrounding Antoinette's relationship with her brother Rainier, it seems her daughter, Elizabeth, always held an esteemed place in her uncle's heart. She was a bridesmaid at his wedding to Grace Kelly, and became godmother to their daughter. Princess Stephanie. 
Elizabeth inherited her mother's positions and won her cousin Prince Albert's trust. She has represented him at royal engagements and has been photographed by his side at official events. Now, it seems, it is the turn of her daughter, Melanie Antoinette, that IT remains to be seen how much of a formal role she will play in the life of Charlene and Albert, but certainly, having another trusted ally would surely only be a boon to the princess, who has her parents by her side in Monaco as she makes a full return to royal duties after her extended absence and treatment for exhaustion. Perhaps her husband's cousin is just the right-hand woman she needs.